In today's video, you're gonna see who can build the strongest, most secure base. That's not even a debate, bro. Of course it's me. Yeah, right, goats. Who's gonna tell him that he's never getting through my sentry turrets? Oh, yeah? Well, you're never gonna get through my lava moat. And if you wanna enter my base, all you have to do is press the like and subscribe button. All right, Sonny, I challenge you to a most secure base build battle. I like it, Melon, and I'm gonna absolutely destroy you. Calm down, Sonny, calm down. I didn't even explain the rules yet. Just die! Go and splat! Are you kidding me? Sonny, enough, 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 bro. The rules are extremely sim- No! Let's go! Got him! Okay, bro. The rules are extremely simple. Just listen to me. I'm the real melon now. No, 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 no. Sonny, just stop. I'm explaining the rules, all right? Okay? So here's how it works. We're gonna take our time, build our bases. We have 24 hours. But at the end of those 24 hours, we each have to infiltrate each other's bases. And whoever takes long- Okay, goats. Melon here. Let me explain the rules of this build battle. We're gonna each have 24 hours to construct the most secure base, and then we're both gonna infiltrate it. I just said that, Sonny! <laughs> I know, I know. I just thought I would echo your sentiment. Yes. Anyway, so when do we start? Sonny, I didn't even finish the rules. And then we'll both infiltrate, and whoever has the lowest time will lose. Yeah, hold on. Let me get rid of this guy. Yeah, so after we infiltrate each other's bases, whoever has the fastest timer wins. No, the fastest timer loses because that means your base sucked. No, no, no. If I escape yours first, I won. Oh, wait, yeah, you're right, actually. That's a good way of putting it. And three, two, one, go! All right, goats, it's time to build my base. Or should I say, grow my base? All I must do to grow it is chant the holy melon song. Okay, goats. So, for my most secure base, I'm gonna theme it around my beautiful face. Ew, wait, not this one. My beautiful face. That's better. And that's much better. Goodbye, melon. Anyways, let's begin. I'm gonna need yellow concrete, yellow wool. Oh, my sunglasses. Yeah, let's go to the concrete palettes. We're gonna need black for the frames. We're gonna need purple and magenta, red, orange, and lime green concrete. Because look at my shades. I've got to build them perfectly. And then I'll figure out my mouth after. Let's see. Something like this. Yeah, that's a pretty good size. We'll just frame this up. Melon, melon, you must grow when I hit you with this magical hoe. Okay, that should be wide enough. I just got to make sure it's 15 blocks tall as well. No way, goats. I think it worked. Check it out. I'm inside my own head. 13, 14, 15. Perfect. Now I just fill in the cube. Just got to bust on out of here. And boom. I have the layout for my most secured base. Now it's time for me to construct some security. But I'm way too lazy to do that myself. So I'm calling in for backup. And voila. With a little magic world edit, it's complete. And that's definitely not cheating. I don't want to hear it. Excellent. Now I must install my sunglasses. I think that's a perfect placement to start. Bring this all the way across the top. It kind of looks like a furrowed eyebrow. What if I just put eyeballs in here like this and looked real kooky? <laughs> I've gone crazy and I've got a furrowed unibrow. Nah, I'm not doing that. Instead, I will have the most perfect sunglasses you've ever seen. Check it out. I don't need purple here though. Let me look at my face. Uh, it's a little bit lower down, and then I put red. Perfect. Then orange, and then green. Yeah, so Bob, pretty much I need you to construct me the most secure base ever. One that'll keep Sunny out forever! Oh, that even rhymed. Yeah, no problem. That'll be a thousand diamond blocks. Oh, Bob. Luckily, I've got creative mode, so that's no problem. Diamond blocks. I don't know why we don't do this more often when we have creative mode. We could literally be rich. But here you go, Bob. Take these diamond blocks. Thanks. I'll begin now. And greens like this. And voila. My sunglasses look epic. Wait, is this the right dimensions? Or is this too thick? Oh, well. It'll do. Now for my little mouth. Let's see. I'm gonna need lighter pink than this. White 
white and a little gray. So we'll grab this, this, and that a one. And it's kind of like that. Put the gray there. And then I got my big smile there. How's that looking? Not too bad. Not too bad. Perfect. That looks good. I got my grin. That's right. Don't mess with me. All right. I'll admit it. It's a little bit derpy and I need to fix it up. Give me a second. Okay. Much better. I had to just increase the dimensions a little bit to get the perfect size. Plus, that's going to give me a lot more building space on the inside. And it's complete. Hope it does the trick. Thank you, Bob. I really appreciate it. There's no way Sonny can make it through my security. Now, let's see. I want to build a security layer on the exterior to prevent Melon from even accessing my head. I'm going to do a wall. And inside of this wall is going to be some crazy contraptions. Oh, yeah. This is going to be cool. And you know what? I'll do terracotta so it looks a little different. Yeah, that's pretty good. Looks a little more intimidating. And with the power of world... At oh, no. That, that was wrong. Okay. And with the power of world at it. It's been done. The walls have been constructed. Now let's see. Within the walls, I need to have a grand entrance. So let's poke a little hole in the wall. Now here's what I want to do. I'm going to make this place super duper confusing. I'm going to construct barriers that he has to get through. And by get through, I mean get over the top of. So let's build it like that. That'll be the first layer. And in order to scale up this wall and make the getaway, he's going to have to acquire four floating blocks. So let's go ahead and set them up like this. Oh yeah, this is gonna be cool. One, two, three, and four. Yep, that's a funky design. Then I'll leave him with a bow and arrow and let him figure it out. Oh yeah, probably need to put blocks in these item frames so he can build over the wall. And he better not miss much. I'm only giving him one extra arrow. He'll take that, destroy the item frames, build up and over like this. And the next area, let's see. How do I want to make him confused? Block it like this. Oh, I've got a good idea. Check this out. Vanishing blocks. Oh, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. And I'll place it like this. I'm going to make a big old cube out of it. He'll have no idea why this is here. Unless he pays attention and looks closely at this button. And if he spots the button and shoots it with his bow, he'll be able to access a sticky piston, one slime, and a spare button. And with that, he'll be able to create a slime jump that can launch him up and over the this wall. Yeah, so pretty much I'm just gonna make a few more of these barricades with different secrets that he's gotta figure out. Alrighty, I finished some of my designs over here, and it's time for the insides. Let's see. This looks like a pretty awesome place to build some parkour. Okay, so he comes inside, and then he's gonna have to do like one of these, one of these jumps, and then we'll do some floating jumps, and I'll make this all look pretty later. Oh, I wanna mess around with honey blocks. I absolutely despise buys these types of jumps. Although Melon's not too bad at them. But yeah, I don't like these. These really annoy me. Okay, this is looking pretty good. I think the last touch is putting some ladders on this wall. <laughs> Otherwise, this is literally impossible. There's no way you can make that jump. So let's go here and then up here, down here, up here. And then he could jump and grab that. Perfect. And if he can complete all of these jumps and access this slime block, he's gonna use it to launch himself up. And in this next area, Area, I think I'm gonna build a maze. But to be honest with you guys, this is gonna be really boring to see me build this. So you'll just have to see what happens when Melon gets to the maze. Okay, I'm at the edge of the maze. And if Melon could make it this far, he'll be able to grab this suit of armor and use the elevator block to teleport himself into this room. And if Melon can defeat these husks, they'll drop pressure plates and buttons that he can use to open this series of doors and complete my most secure base. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's gonna die horribly. And if not, let me at least put one sentry turret because they're hilarious. You know what? Let's put two of them. Actually, ah, uh, then these husks are gonna get shot. Oh, well. Time's up. No more building, Melon. It's time for you to try and conquer my most secure base. Yeah, bro. I totally built so much myself. That's a bit sus because it's obvious that you built, bro. We literally had 24 hours to create the most secure base. I built myself, Sonny. Okay, bro. You're being sus. Anyways, Sonny, <sighs> it's time to take out your base. Your security looks hecka weak. Yeah, right, bro. Get down there and find out. Ah! <laughs> you couldn't even get through the spawn. Sonny, let me show you how it's done. You got a backwards jump. Creative mode. Hey, too easy. Oh, dude, hold on, hold on. Give me a second. Don't move. Don't move. Let me get rid of these. Gross. Absolutely disgusting. Sonny! 
Hey! Actually, I don't even care about that. That's not a real watermelon. Bro, it was literally your head! Anyways, I guess you've lost your mind. So good luck getting through my secure base. It's gonna be easy, Sonny. All I gotta do is this. No, 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 no. You, you, my friend, are going in adventure mode. No! Ow! Now I'm at three hearts. Welcome to my most secure base, Melon. Come on in and see if you can solve all the puzzles. No problem. Let me just first grab a bow and interesting. I feel like I might have to use this. Now I must warn you, you have exactly five arrows and you do need all five of them. All right. Well, something's sus here, Shunny. Actually, no, it's chill. There's no ghost blocks at all. I thought you were going to kill me or something like that. No, why would I do that? I'm trying to keep you out of my house. You think I want to be burying your nasty melon body here? Do I do though? I oh, wait, I see it now. I've just got to shoot these sand things, I guess. Whatever those are. You could do it. Don't miss. Hey, yeah. Hey, I got it. Nice shot, bro. Now you're one step closer to getting over this wall. Boom. Shoot this one. Yes. And actually, I don't even have to waste all four arrows here. Bang. Oh, wait, I do. <laughs> What are you doing? Why are you building one by one? Sonny, you don't understand. Now I gotta use an extra arrow. Well played. You literally handed yourself an L. Sonny, can I get another arrow? <sighs> I feel bad for you, bro. Here, have a stack of arrows. Get lost. Ow. Oh, there was hay blocks here for me, wasn't there? Yeah, I was trying to look out for your well-being. Anyways, how the heck was I possibly supposed to do this with only five arrows? It doesn't even make sense. Oh, you weren't. I just wanted to see you squirm a bit. You're so annoying, Sonny. But now I've shot all your blocks down. This is gonna be easy peasy. And bro, I won't even cap. You did that flawlessly. Yeah, because I'm a goat. I am a goat. And I'll save this block for later. Okay, if you're such a goat, can you figure out what to do next? Probably shoot these vanishing blocks. Yeah, shoot them. See if it works. Nothing. Dang it. Guys, I am totally not hiding the button from him with my face. Totally not doing that. Anyways, there's gotta be something down here to get those vanishing blocks to disappear. I've just gotta search around thoroughly. Yep, there sure must be. You you are right about that one. Come on, Melon. Time's ticking. Hurry up. Sonny, can you please move? You're standing suspiciously in the same place. All right, I'll twist a little bit. Is that good? Is that I see? It looks like the pixel of a wooden button. No, there's nothing here. There's nothing here. Get out of the way. Fine, fine. You're going to miss anyway. I knew there was a button there. Let's go. Dang it. Give me this and this. And uh, now, I've got a button, a sticky piston, and a slime block. <laughs> You've already messed up. It's okay, I can break this. And bang, bada bingo, kaboygan. Let's go, Sonny! I didn't do anything. You so did that. Did what, bro? You're just not good at this. That's it, I'm using my extra block. Oh, come on, one more time, one more time. Bro, this is sad. There we go, I've crossed your wall. And now, I shall claim victory. Yeah? How's victory taste? There's still more, this is so annoying. You're only just getting started, Melon. So you better speed up. All right, I just gotta shoot this target. Oh, that was actually pretty easy. I think I get this. Yeah, you just gotta do it slowly. Let it cook. Oh, wait. Um, stop. Stop it. You're cheating. I'm trying to let it cook. You're cheating. Yeah, it would have probably been a lot better for you if you were just standing under it the whole time. Nope, now I can grab the blocks, Sonny. Not if I were to cook them. Sand doesn't get cooked. Everyone knows that. Okay. Okay, let's see. No, you actually burned one, but I still have enough blocks to get up. Oh my goodness, you actually burnt multiple of them. Sonny, you cheater! <laughs> I thought you said the sand can't get cooked. You're such a cheese lord. Just let me play the game. Bro, are you gonna land on any of my hay bales? I'm trying to help you. Sonny, you don't think I know your tricks? One of these is real, and the rest are ghost blocks, I bet. No, that would be cringe. Meaning this one is the real. Bro, there's totally no ghost blocks here. And easy. You think I'm gonna fall for such a simple trap? Whatever, bruh. I am no idiot. <laughs> you sure about that one? I'm 
I'm sure. I just don't really understand what's going on here. Nor shall you ever uncover the mysteries. What does it even do? That one actually worked! Oh, yeah? I'll tell you what else works. These sentry turret- Oh, wait, you're out of vision. No! What? No! Ghost blocks! <laughs> you fell for it! All I had to do was create the perfect distraction. All right, Sonny. I'm not falling for that twice. The ghost blocks are near. Can you smell them? No, not the stupid sentry! <laughs> Good luck over here, bro. Bro, how do I even cross the ghost blocks? Maybe you have to jump. I've just got to make the jump! Go, go, go! No, not the stupid sentries! But I made it. I've made it! Let me in! No way! I can't believe you got past my outer security ring. And now I'm in the inner security ring. Yeah, but good luck completing this parkour, dude. I know this is your weakness. We shall see about that, Sonny. Check me out. I'm speedrunning. I'm speedrunning. Yeah, but now what's gonna happen? I'm just gonna keep on winning. Ladder parkour doesn't affect me anymore. No! No! Sonny, you can't put a sentry in here. You're just cheating. You're just cheating. You, you don't make the rules. I do. Whoa, dude. I just made a new rule. I can use creative mode. No! No! Stop! Stop! Up. There are no centuries, Sonny. Deal. And yes, yes, I shall. You didn't say anything about lava. Sonny, I hope you know I'm getting you back for this in threefold. No, you really shouldn't do that, Melon, because you're not out of here yet. What if I keep pranking you, huh? Just stop pranking me, Sonny. You're literally avoiding the pr No! You pranked me again! I didn't do a thing, and I have video evidence. Nope, nope, nope. I'm coming back up. I'm coming back up. Time is ticking, bro. You keep slipping. I did that one on purpose because I'm a man of honor. Yeah, you sure about that? Aren't you a melon of honor? I'm a melon of many things, Sonny. And parkour is not one of them. Just gotta conquer the ladders. Oh, these are my least favorite ones. No! Wait, I'm still on. I'm still on. I'm still on. Melon, chill. I'm gonna help you. Look up. No, I don't want you... No, stop it! Stop it, Sonny. That's not funny. That's not funny. No, I'm helping. Oh, wait, that actually helped. Thank you. See, I told you I was helping. I just felt bad for you. Now, I should complete this park. Thanks for the help, Sonny. Look what you've done. Hold on, hold on. I'll put it out. There we go. Move this water, please. Yeah, yeah, I'll get rid of it as well. Happy? And make a job! That was sick. Sonny, I gotta be honest, your parkour is pretty cool. I know it is, brother. Almost as cool as school. And I'm heading to your next layer of security in one more try. Yeah! Oh, Sonny, it looks like I'm in a maze. And there's no way you can escape it. Watch me, Sonny. First try, right, and a then a right, then a right again, and then a left. Dang it, I reached a dead end! And it would be a real shame, Melon, if this happened. What happened? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. As long as it's nothing, I'm good with that. Oh, Melon, I think I found the way you need to go. It's over by me. Bro, that's such cap. I know you're just trying to lead me astray right now. What What do you have in your hand? Nothing. A grass block. All right, that's... Ah! Wait a second. I can use this to destroy your maze and get out of here! No, that's literally cheating! Uh, never mind, Sonny. That leads into the void somehow. <laughs> yeah, we don't question these things, Melon. We don't question these things. I need to get out of here, but I'm so lost. Please show me the exit somewhere. Oh yeah, I don't even know where it is. This place is really confusing. Come on. It's gotta be over here, right? Over here, I'm going somewhere. Dang it, I reached another dead end. No, it's not this way. Sonny, you've made the most confusing maze ever. I'm amazed. But wait, I found the way out! Actually, I don't know if it's the way out, but it's got golden armor. Bro, there's no way you solved my maze already. Dang it! And this looks like an elevator. What if I go up. Ah! Ah! What is this? Good luck with this, Melon. Dude, there's there's nowhere safe for me to go. This is impossible. How am I supposed to survive? If you have a big intellect, you could use the sentry turrets to your advantage. I need to have the big intellect here. Hit the zombies! Hit the zombies! It's actually working for you. There's gotta be a way out of here. There's gotta be somewhere I can go. Oh, I can go over on this side. No, no, you cannot do that. Oh, two hearts! Two hearts! How are you alive? And I'm killing the zombies! Two hearts again. Two hearts again. Oh no. But I did it! 
And I see how this works, Sonny. There's levers and a pressure plate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you're not in there yet. There's still a sentry turret for you to dismantle. I've just got to go quick. Ow, 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 ow. Go away. You, you know I gave you a pickaxe for a reason. You could just destroy the sentry. No, Sonny. I'm a man of honor. I wouldn't do such a thing. Go, 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 go. Oh, I made it in. No way you pulled that off. Yep. And now I... Oh, my God. I'm at one heart. Oh, my goodness. What is it? Sonny, you cheats! Hey, Melon, hey, Melon, hey, Melon, hey, Melon, look behind you. Stop it, Sonny! <laughs> Fine, I'll get rid of him. You can't be cheating like this. I stopped, I stopped. Hurry up, bro, the clock is ticking. What are you doing? I don't trust you. Now? Sonny, there's a command block here. Yeah, that's the ending. Just put the pressure plate on it and you win. And... Double 10! Congratulations, Melon! You're now forever stranded inside of my head! That's the ultimate security! Turning it into a prison. Yes, yeah, Sonny, but I know how to escape. How? Just like this. No way! Goats, I can't believe he discovered the only way out. The afterlife. Pressing respawn. Curse him! Uh, anyways, Melon, it's time for you to show off your build. Oh, I told you to leave. What are you still doing here? Uh, oh, hi, Sonny. Yeah, Melon, what's going on here? Why are you talking to Bob the Builder? Nah, I don't know. Bob, who's Bob? What's going on? I don't see a Bob. I literally am, you know what? Yeah, there's no Bob. You're right. There, there's no Bob. Anyways, welcome to the base that I built myself, Sonny. Good luck figuring out my security. I think the first step is to place a block there and then jump. Was I right? Can't believe you figured it out. You needed blocks to get through, but now I'm clearing your inventory. No blocks for Sonny. Oh, well, at least I used my water bucket quickly. Now, can you figure out how to get through? You should have taken your time and looked at every single area. Every single area? Bro, there's the grand entrance. I need to figure out a way to access your front door that goes through your mouth. Ugh, it's gonna be smelly in there like your breath, but all I see here is a redstone link and a lever, but it doesn't do anything. Yes, Sonny. All right, I gotta give you a pickaxe. I ain't gonna cap. Here you go. It's the only way it's possible. Now, good luck figuring this out. <sighs> so I probably missed a mystery over here somewhere. Ow. Let's see. There's totally something on the outskirts of your base. I can feel it. Oh, wait. There's actually nothing back here. Wait a second. Maybe up in the air? No, I don't see anything. Ah, uh, Sonny, you really are stupid. Coach, the way he needs to figure this out is he needs to look at the back of the redstone links. And this way, he can link them up properly, activating the redstone and opening the iron door. Wait a second. There's receiver nodes on the back of each of these iron doors. But it looks like there's nothing in them. I am confused. Wait a second. Maybe it's just because I'm too far away. I bet you I have to be right up against them. I gotta get in close. Come on. Come on. And come on. See through the door. Look through the glass. Red block! Oh, Melon. Nice try. Oh, yeah? Did you figure it out, Sonny? Ah! Uh, Oh, I did. I need to dismantle your wall. That's the first clue. You only need one. You only need one. It doesn't take it from your inventory. Well, I'm taking some yellow just in case. And I'm dead. And now I can access the next zone. I just place it in frequency one and flick the switch. It actually worked! All right, Sonny, you're kind of smart for going in F5. I didn't even think about that. And then I put it in frequency two. Let's go. Oh, Melon, you need two red blocks for this one. You think you can stop me with this? Dang it, it wasn't enough, boys. But it's time to troll him, because he trolled me. Wait a second. This one's not red blocks. It looks like dirt. All right. Melon, this is not secure at all. Ow! What is hitting me? No way! Okay, I can do this. You better be real fast, Sonny. No, no. I can cover it. I can cover it. I'm chilling. What is this? What is this? Again. Ow! Ow! This time it goes on the bottom. No! I misclicked! Oh, it's over for you, Sonny! Phew! I'm through. What the heck is hitting me now? Oh, sorry. I spawned in another one by accident. And I spawned in a bunch more by accident. Mel melon, 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 melon. Oh, they can't see me down here. Hold on. Let me put them a little lower. No, you really don't have to do that. Besides, there's no lever here. Cool. Really cool. That's what you get for trolling me all those times. Oh, yeah? Well, while you're busy placing sentry turrets, I'm busy winning. No! No, you're not allowed to do that! Go up, clear your inventory! No! <laughs> I don't care if you clear my inventory. I'm on to the next level of your security. Dang it! Yo, what is this place? It actually looks amazing! Yep, and you'll never get through it, Shuddy. I, myself, with 
with no help required, built the most ultimate parkour. Why do you keep saying that, bro? Let me guess, Bob the Builder helped you make this. No, he didn't help me. Technically, he didn't help me. Because I didn't do anything, so technically, he did not help me. Let me guess, Melon, in the fine print, he didn't help you because you paid him off. Yeah, something like that. Ooh, just grab the ladder, make the next jump, and I'm not gonna cap, bro. This place is looking juicy. It is looking juicy. It's completely melon-themed. Also, good luck getting through the lava, man. This part's pretty tough. Bro, you shouldn't have. You brought my biggest fan? Not funny, Sonny. Whatever. Let me just dodge your lovers. I'm almost there, bro. This thing is blasting me way above them. Ow! It creates hot air, though. Oh, no. I might die. Melon, why? Oh, sorry. That was an accident. Meant to just push you out of the lava a little bit. Ugh, I gotta start the whole thing over again. Ugh, I finally made it back, bro. Don't troll me again. Oh, remember all the times you trolled me, Sonny? I do, but we had an agreement that you wouldn't do it back to me. Hey, this is actually so easy. You just go beneath the lava. Yeah, bro. All I had to do was hold shift. Dang it. What was Bob thinking? I mean, uh, uh, what was I thinking? Wait, bro. Bob did build everything for you. No, uh, he didn't build everything. I technically grew the melon myself, so goats, that counts. Melon, name one thing he didn't build here. The melon. Oh, good point. Yo, this part looks crazy. Ah, I almost slipped. Vine parkour. I've never even had to do this before. Oh, that's unfortunate, Sonny. Melon, please never build with these again. Uh, mm, I kind of like it. It's difficult for you, Sonny. Let me rephrase that. Melon, please never hire Bob to build with vines again. Bro, how do you know Bob built that? Well, it wasn't you, bro. You're not that creative. He's going up. You already finished my parkour. Dang right I did. I'm out of here. Whoa. You built a maze in your head also? Of course I did, Sonny. I guess we kind of were on the same page with our builds. Yeah, and now I'm totally lost and don't know where I'm going. And I totally am not spawning in zombie villagers. Melon, why? Why would you do that? Uh, because you decided to spawn in creepers. No, I didn't spawn them in. They, uh, they were natural. Those, those were all natural GMO-free creepers. Organic. And these are all natural GMO uh, villager zombies that I spawned. And I found the secret chest. And you've got armor in here, too. Let's go, Melon. See you, nerd. Dang it. Aw, uh, Melon. Why are there muted zombies? Good luck. Not cool, bro. Not cool. How am I supposed to kill these guys? I only have iron armor. There's two of them. Oh, uh, hold on. Let me make this a little more fair, actually. And if you can get that ammo in time and that minigun, uh... There's no ammo. You lied. Dude, the ammo's right there. You just gotta get to it. Oh, no. Die. Die. Plus, these guys don't even die when I kill them. I need a flint and steel. Oh, wait. One of them's dead. Let me reload this thing. Oh, Melon. That was actually pretty easy. Thanks for the help. You're welcome, Sonny. It's only because you put that water down for me that one time. And now I have a swipey key card to open the reinforced secure door and a pressure plate for the command block. I'm out of here. Oh, no. I should have seen this coming. Yep, Sonny. You have now imprisoned yourself in the Melon facility forever. And you don't have a bow and arrow to kill yourself, so you can never escape dang it goats please press the like and subscribe button to help me escape from this juicy watermelon